Are we are we up? Are we good? I okay. Welcome my fellow agents. Question mark. Welcome to part two of Gals. <laughs> Yo. Okay. My screencast of like <laughs> as soon as I ended the last thing, screencastify just started to lag out. I think I have the oh, get out of here. I think I have the um the recording, hopefully I do. But uh, I had to restart my computer to record once more on this. But welcome back to part two of uh, of delving into the deep web, <laughs> I guess. Um, all right. Uh, let's see. Leather accessory model. Oh, yeah. Um, oh, no. We don't, we don't want no leather. We don't want no leather. Uh, special instructions. Um Flash these nuts and hail <laughs> Satan. <laughs> I guess. Let's see here. Unit price is one hundred dollars. For this, this is a hundred bucks. Oh my god. Okay, so as you can see, we finished the uh, thing. Um, <laughs> hey, <laughs> let's print. <laughs> we can print this design or we can email it. Okay, seriously, yeah. yeah. This is just ridiculous, dude. Let's see what else we got. We got women, dude. We got women. Okay, let's go back to gear. Um, what about Smith & Wesson? Let's see what gear... Smith and Wesson could possibly sell to policemen, policemen and women, men and women on the force. Smith and Wesson make handcuffs. Oh, and batons and knives, you know. Leg irons, knife, watches. So okay, <clears throat> surprising. Not one gun yet. Do they have guns on this site? Okay, transport restraints. They've got to have guns somewhere here, right? They gotta. Well, they got clothing, like badges and custom badges, belts, bike patrols, jumpsuits. Oh, I bet. Let's see here. Polos and uniforms. How to measure. Gee, I wonder how to measure my own body. Let's see. Footwear, duty boots, fire boots, military boots, quarter boots, tactical boots. Oh, boots. Um, oh, come on. This is basically a police site. They gotta have some sort of... They got holsters? Handcuffs? Do they... I don't... Maybe they... Riot gear. Let's see what riot gear they sell. I, surprise, I, I have not seen one real gun on the site. Uh, chest protectors, tactical vests, elbow pads, knee pads, tactical goggles. Man, like... <sighs> Forced entry tools. <laughs> now, this is making me wonder. This makes me wonder, really. Um, do you actually have to, like, register? Do you have to register and make it known that you are a military and or police, emergency services, whatever, official, like, or, or a company, or like department do you do you have to do you have to show that you are indeed a a member of of emergency services because because like if not then this this is just dangerous but i mean at least they're not selling guns can we yeah at least we're just not selling guns to everybody like to, to get those guns you got to go to walmart all right here in america yeah here in America, you gotta go to Walmart for them guns. But seriously, like, I really want to know: <laughs> could could someone just straight up order a bunch of stuff and just commit like stolen valor of like police or military? I I really hope not. Like, you know, just <laughs> I mean, I guess just to wrap all of this up, you know, like this this website, I get what they're doing, right? They're like up and coming to police departments or whatever, ones that aren't really funded by the populace. They're trying to help them out, you know? They're trying to 
give them some affordable options for, you know, gear and stuff. Just, yeah, I'm going to look on survival while, while I'm talking. Just trying to give them some affordable options for, for just training their police officers, for giving them gear for all types of stuff. It's, it's, in, it's all in good nature, but, <laughs> but it's just funny to, to see this because I've never seen this website before. And I have no clue how many people actually shop on it. Like how many people, how many people you think actually came on here and bought like a batch of uniforms and handcuffs and holsters? Like, let's be honest here, like, or have individual people, like have individual police officers came on here and just bought some, like bought some training knives or, or <laughs> riot gear, perhaps like. It's just, it's just crazy to think that stuff like this is out there. Like the internet, the internet's a weird place, man. Like I'll give you an example right now. This is a website I like to go to and it's not, it's not sinister or anything. It doesn't, it, it is a shopping website. However, it's just, it's all fun. This is a, this is a fun shopping website. It's called, it's called this. There it is weird weird stuff you can buy.com as you can see or maybe not see it's it's not, it says not secure but let's be honest here it's it's all right <laughs> i don't know <laughs> the originals they sell a whole bunch of stuff like bread slippers snotmans roast beef sandwich bath soaks cat butt tissue holsters does it fart we gotta know iPhone X case, if you could see that. Oh. <laughs> uh, abusive party balloons. Bare arms t-shirt. This thing. Set of ten finger hands. It just it just has triple bristle electric toothbrush. This body brain head yeah. <laughs> it just has a bunch of a bunch of weird stuff that you can buy, you know, Mr. Sneeze egg separators. It's, <laughs> but this, this, this website, it doesn't, but face soap, it doesn't sell anything. Well, it sells things. It, it does sell bad things, I should say, but it doesn't sell anything like sinister or anything. It just, it's all in good fun. It's just, it's a great website. I recommend <laughs> I was about to say I recommend this site to, to I recommend this site to anyone like me if you're looking for some if you're looking for some things that you just want to spend your money on because you just have too much of it. Oh, here's a knife coffee mug, an unt coffee mug. Um, draw those conclusions yourself. Panda puzzle. <laughs> they just <laughs> they just sell honestly ridiculous stuff. That you could that you could show your friends you bought if you choose to, <laughs> like some peckermints. Is yeah, it's <laughs> it's a really bad website, but it sells some pretty funny stuff, like unicorn mask and hooves. Just I recommend this site if you have money and you don't really have anything else to spend it on. I guess like I know you p penny pinchers out there won't really buy into this stuff, but. I, I would buy some bread slippers just to have them, you know, like, <laughs> oh my God, instead of 10 finger, I really want to know what this is actually, 10 finger hands, it's eight bucks, what does this do, are they gloves, oh, they're finger puppets, oh, okay, okay, well, yeah, if, if you want to, if you want a good laugh, go to this website you don't even have to buy anything it's just a good laugh to see what they got they add stuff just about like every week i'm sure um it, yeah it's pretty fun but uh yeah uh that <laughs> that wraps it up okay that wraps it up i guess uh <laughs> thanks for watching and um see you later let's